Happy Wednesday, everyone. Thanks for checking in as we take a look at your post-Christmas weather forecast. Hope you had a wonderful Christmas with family and friends. Unfortunately, travelers across the central U.S. will have some issues as a major winter storm unfolds. And from the front range of the Rockies to the upper Midwest, very heavy snow developing. And on the southern edge of this, we have severe weather concerns. In fact, an enhanced risk today with the threat of tornadoes south of the Dallas-Fort Worth area in Texas. And then the extended outlook into uh, early January shows that it is going to be colder than average across the southwest. But for now, a number of winter weather advisories here from the Four Corners region all the way up into the uh, international border from uh, North Dakota to Minnesota. That's where we could see upwards of a foot of snow. And again, this is going to have some big travel impacts, especially as we get into Thursday and Friday as the wind cranks up and uh, reduce visibilities with the snow blowing around. But there you go, Fargo over to Duluth, maybe a foot of snow or more. The Twin Cities will be less less in terms of snowfall or see less snowfall due to the fact that it'll be rain and maybe even a mixture of freezing rain at points. But we could see close to a half an inch uh, to an inch and a half of total liquid through that time period through the end of the week here. So your heaviest snow is going to be to the far north and west where it'll be cold enough for the majority of the storm system to pick up all snow. Twin Cities will initially see snow but then transitioning over to rain into our Thursday and then the tail end of that Thursday night into early Friday a little bit more snowfall. As we head far south showers and storms breaking out later on today and tonight so I mentioned large hail damaging winds and even the potential of tornadoes but very heavy rainfall which could lead to some flood concerns there's your enhanced threat again south of the Dallas area northwest of Houston and then the threat does shift a little bit farther east into our Thursday but also looking at some heavy rain in the southeast through the end of the week with some one to two inch rainfall tallies temperatures today in the central part of the country will be a little bit warmer than average have a good one